I think this is hilarious. A whole big bunch of fun. The greatest show on satellite radio today. This show is like the box of chocolates that Forrest's mother was talking about. You're a no good son of a bitch. Fuck you, you motherfucker. We're so much fucking better than you. Absolute lunacy. If you're giving me the hook, fine, whatever. Well, what's I, going I do on? what I'm told. I'm completely out of control. It doesn't get better than this. Come on, it's shocking. But enough of this palaver. Let's get the show on the road. The hell's going on? Who's Oscar? Oscar. Yeah, who's this Oscar, Oscar guy? Who the fuck is Oscar? Where's E Rock? E Rock just got here like 10 minutes ago, so cut him some slack. Oh, E Rock. <laughs> so cut him some slack? <laughs> well, you just told the world that he was late yeah. again oh, for are work. We on the air? Sam came in and. So you yeah. guys are supposed to stick up for each other and, and cover for each other. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> what do you mean E Rock just showed up 10 minutes ago? He just got here like 10 minutes ago. I'm saying go I easy. Turn down the fucking music. Holy shit. Yes. What is it, switch jobs uh, day? <laughs> well, we're all we're covering and stuff, so, you know. Why did E-Rock just show up? He probably had a late night or something, you know. Uh, yeah. Probably, I don't know, playing video games. I thought games maybe he was or... tired from uh, maybe the working out with the trainer. All uh, right, no, come on. No? Don't be facetious. That, well, <laughs> where is he? And he's probably just in the office getting it, putting his stuff down. <laughs> oh, oh, that's good. <laughs> you are such a prick. What? Just selling them out. I didn't even know we were on the air. Well, he so should. I... Everyone else gets here at a nice early hour. Yeah. I hear you. Iraq, why are you late? Oh, why is Oscar right. handling all your <laughs> in-studio duties? He's just a fucking intern. The eyes are a little glassy, too. Oscar didn't have the templates on the 360s no, out. No, nothing. And nobody had checked the studio. And Ant tried to push a button before the show. He didn't know what button did what. I didn't he know. He doesn't need that kind How of stress. How would I know? He's the Why creative force. The Rock. Okay, well, I don't handle the replays in the morning. Oh, but I, oh, oh, I like it. There it is. <laughs> Ladies and gentlemen, the passing of the Bach. Who handles uh, the replays? Uh, usually they're in here before everybody else is, so the interns... Oh, they wait, 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 they just, just appear? So you mean they before you are. They just before. magically appear. That's good. <laughs> That's I never great. hit these things up. So who does? Who does? Usually the interns come in. But who's responsible the for the in-studio yeah, yeah, yeah. setup? I don't want the interns doing that. It seems like a lot of responsibility. That it... Let me see if it works. <laughs> right. okay. It's working. Where were you? <laughs> you got a I wasn't even going to say that you were late. This idiot had, uh, just told the world <laughs> that you're, you were late. I didn't know we were on the air. Mm -hmm. Yeah, Sam had no idea. He thought he was just telling us off mic. Yeah. I say cut you some slack, to be fair. Where were you? I was running late today. <laughs> <laughs> the way he says it. I was running late today. Why were you running late today? I just was. <laughs> How are you supposed to get ahead in this world? <laughs> oh, God. Any other boss would be like, you know what, go home. Oh, wow. They Man. would, though. But in radio, you can do whatever the fuck you want. Don't ask me these tough questions. He just woke up. <laughs> oh, fuck, Why are you running late, Rock? Walk us through it. Uh, okay. Uh, a bit, I had a bit of a late uh, night last night, and then I only set one of my two alarms. I had a bit of a what? I had a bit of a late... late. Uh. Oh. <laughs> <laughs> I didn't hear his dry mouth. What the oh, hell's going on? Oh, my God. Something's up here. Why did you have a late night? I just did. Were you drinking? No. I don't drink. I should, but I don't. <laughs> you have dry mouth. You're stammering. You usually don't stammer. So what's going on? Why the late night? I had some stuff to do, and uh, I got home... <laughs> Late from uh, from work the here. Vagueness. I hate Good. vagueness. Vague. <laughs> I hate it more than anything. Vague. Just fucking tell us what happened. I got home late. Ooh. And don't yell at me. Oh, he, no. fucking, hey. he fucking brought hey. it to our attention. But oh. I did it in your defense. Address Sam because he's, he's very. I did it in your oh. defense. Oh. That's not. That's Address not Sam because he's very concerned that he's here on time and you weren't. Yes. 
I didn't even know. I mean, I you know I don't get home till like six o'clock at night. It so what happened? Me. And stop with the vagueness. Go ahead. Uh, I got home. Address Sam, not me. <laughs> <laughs> I got home about like nine nine thirty. From where? I, uh, we left work here, and then I we went to dinner, and then. You were here no. until 9 at night? I was here until about 8 last night. What were you doing until 8 o'clock at night here? I had some stuff to do. <laughs> Get the fuck out of here. Shut up. You don't know what I was doing. Whoa. Whoa. What was it? Yeah, but if you're going to be vague about it, what were you doing until 8 o'clock no last night? to be here at 8 o'clock at Okay, night. there was a reason I had to be here till 8 o'clock last night, because I had to get a bunch of the weekend stuff done, because I have to leave as soon as the show's done today. So I had no time to do anything else today. So I had to do it all yesterday. Well, you could have done it earlier in the week. No, I couldn't have. I had to do it yesterday. How come? Because that's when we recorded the stuff. Can I just weekend. ask a serious question? I'm not even shitting on you. <laughs> yes. I swear I'm not even shitting on you. When I, when I used to take care of the weekend stuff, oh, I was again. never here until 8 o'clock. Yes. Oh. I, I'm just one, dude, I'm just saying, because, dude, there's never a time. Yes, but you also didn't have management um, going over. That's true. Over and over. Okay. No, oh, this part is, should be in here. Fair. This part should be taken out. Why aren't you teasing for the, like 9 million times throughout the entire program? So oh. you have to go back and recut. I don't like that he's blaming management for his lateness. Oh. That's not cool. I wasn't blaming management oh. for my cool. lateness. So you're, you left here at 9, so you were here about 16 hours yesterday. It was a long day. <laughs> That's crazy. It was a long day. <laughs> but you could, we could have but that just gotten in the studio and recorded earlier, and we could have done it throughout the week instead of doing it all in really? one day. Really? And who gets us the studio time? I could get it if you want. You were out of here. You're out of here early every day that we don't do it. I remember, so. there, but Sam, do you remember that one time where Eric he couldn't record for whatever reason, so me and you had to do the the weekend recording? Yeah, I've done I've done the weekend it's countdown. Such, it's it's no joke. It seriously did take tens of minutes. Tens of minutes. I, I've done the countdown twice, and I've never been at here doing the countdown mm -hmm. later than 3 o'clock. Okay, and it doesn't sound as good. Is that, so, I need to put in whatever, the extra five hours, and it sounds that much better. That's the difference. It's the attention, I didn't get it's one the attention to detail, Sarah, that <laughs> you're not paying attention to here. I had a about... different co-host for every break. <laughs> <laughs> I don't pay attention to detail. <laughs> Brett Michaels was one of my co-hosts. <laughs> oh, shit. All right, so E-Rock, 9, 9.30, you left here last <laughs> night, so I guess you figured, well, I, I put in a 16-hour day. I could be late on Friday. No. So why late? I woke up late. <laughs> how, do, how do you wake up late? Simple. You don't hear the first alarm. And the second alarm is the usual, the one that wakes me up, and I forgot to set it. Sam, is that acceptable to you? Well, I mean, I wouldn't have accepted it from Derek the intern, so I don't know. You know, <laughs> <laughs> he's just a kid. <laughs> Didn't even get paid a lot. <laughs> oh, wow. But why the uh, dry mouth and the <laughs> stammering today? I don't know, maybe on a, you know, show that airs in two countries, right off the top of the bat. Hey, you fucked up. Come I in and talk say, about it. Top I didn't say bat. that. Sam just... <laughs> top of the bat. <laughs> Sam, I'd throw that in. Oh, what'd you say? I'm sorry. Top of the right bat. Off the top of the bat. Uh, <laughs> right off the top expression. or right off the bat. <laughs> One or the other. <laughs> All right, well, I guess we're ready to broadcast. <laughs> Now that yeah. Erox here, <laughs> <laughs> yeah, because you needed me to, to do all this. So. Well, Troy was Troy. Oh, oh, damn. Oh, Troy was panicking this morning because he didn't know where the stuff in the light was, and Erox wasn't around. That's the only reason we were talking about it. Yeah, it seems like we need you here before we start broadcasting. <laughs> and, oh, and then we don't oh, have to do the rest of the morning. Troy. Troy. Yeah, the morning that I desperately need him, I'm like, one more. Where's Eric? <laughs> nobody, nobody knows where he is. I'm texting him. I'm calling him. And he decided to move stuff in Dillette and not tell me. Yeah, something else is going on. He rocks oh, being no. way too vague. So you, uh, you couldn't find something you needed. Well, nobody else knows where it is, and he moved it yesterday. So and I was like, well, when were you going to tell me this? Yeah. I forgot to tell Troy. <laughs> <laughs> we made some updates yesterday, and I forgot to tell Troy. Well, you're spending an extra five hours doing a worst stuff show that's half stuff from years ago. <laughs> it's not even all from this week. <laughs> <laughs> Are you annoyed that he's late? Yes. <laughs> <laughs> Why, Sam? Because he used to use the excuse that he was here until like 5 or 6 o'clock. That mm -hmm. was his old excuse. 
But I'm here till five or six o'clock every day now, and I've never been late. And it takes me an hour to get home. Damn. Yeah, they got Sam on a weird schedule. So he leaves yeah. here at five every day. Takes takes an hour to get home, and then rush hour, and then leaves. You know, a mere seven hours later to come back. Eight hours later. <laughs> but I'm the chump who still shows up on time. <laughs> you can start showing up late. <laughs> really? <laughs> yes. No one keeps track of this shit. Oh, I guess man. I just... Who keeps track of this shit? All you gotta shit? do is come in the other door and then sneak around. <laughs> right. So nobody knows you're coming. Troy's picked up on Eric straight to the studio trick that he perfected years ago. <laughs> Wait, what's that now? <laughs> well, we went over it. Wait, Wait I want to hear Troy's. Uh, oh, I want to hear it from Troy. Well, I was going to the bathroom. I was going down this hallway and he's walking in with his, his uh, backpack. Right. Like, why don't you drop your shit off in your office before you come in? He's like, well, I'd just like to go back to the studio.